I would like to base this video on Hodgkin and Huxley's model of neurons that basically explains neurons as electric circuits with the organization and movement of positive and negative charge. The positive and negative charge is in the form of ion atoms. The neuron membrane acts as a boundary separating charge with ionic gates embedded in the cell membrane, forming the potential for the buildup and movement of ion charge. This process can form signals along the neurons with the potential difference across the cell membrane forming what is called an action potential. The big question is how can this process of electrical activity form consciousness? To answer this question we have to look deeper into the process. When we do this we find that the movement or actions of charged particles like ions emit photon energy. Therefore this whole process can be based on an interpretation of quantum mechanics. In the theory explained in these videos, quantum mechanics represents the physics of time as a physical process. The uncertainty of quantum mechanics is the same uncertainty we have with any future event. We have a probabilistic uncertain future coming into existence with the absorption and emission of light photon energy. With each photon electron interaction, a potential future is emitted as a wave of probability with the past being annihilated in the form of antimatter annihilation. Because light has momentum and momentum is frame dependent, we can place each individual life form in the center of their own reference frame in the moment of now. This can give us the concept of the individual mind, with each one of us having our own personal view of the universe, being able to look back in time, in every direction, at the beauty of the stars. In such a theory, consciousness is the most advanced part of a universal process of energy exchange that forms our ever-changing world. 